One Milwaukee family is thankful to be alive tonight after their home burned this morning. As Brett Vickery tells us, fires like this one are all too common this time of year. When I woke up, all I did was feel smoke in my lungs. Sydney Brenwall was asleep when the home she just moved into a month ago started burning to the ground around 9 o'clock Thanksgiving morning. I just moved in here from a rough thing and everything, so I'm just... We don't know what we're going to do. All of our clothes are burnt up, everything. She lived here off of 15th Street with her aunt and three little cousins, all gearing up to spend Thanksgiving together. Thankfully, the entire family was on the second floor and able to get out safely. Fire officials tell us the blaze started in the basement and progressed all the way up to the roof. I was sleeping, and I'm really glad that I had an angel on my side to wake me up and get me out of there with the kids. We had no shoes on. We had no jackets on. <laughs> out of the house, but it's just crazy. The Red Cross is assisting with things such as food, clothing, and housing during this tough time, but they tell us this isn't the first family they've helped since the cold weather has hit. They've helped 256 people who have been displaced by 59 different fires in Wisconsin since November 1st alone, which is just a reminder to be careful when you're cooking this season and make sure your smoke alarms are working. Now, despite her grief, Brenwall is still remembering what she's thankful for. People can't be replaced, but things can. I'm just really shocked that happened. Two firefighters were injured in the blaze. One was taken to St. Mary's for some minor burns. The other fell down some stairs but was not seriously hurt. For more tips on how to keep yourself and your home safe from fires this season, head to fox6now.com. Reporting in Milwaukee, Brett Vickery, Fox 6 News.